I don't know exactly where we are, but uh, it's a big mall. It's a big mall just just for chilling and maybe so for uh, for buy some uh, some uh, souvenir. How do you say souvenir? Uh, memories. Some memories, exactly. Damn! Non, c'est pas un cas. Wouah! <rire> Mec! T'as cru que c'était un mannequin ou pas? Si, quand tu m'as dit que c'était un mannequin. Vous allez dire, wow, ils sont sophistiqués hein, dans les mannequins. Est, euh, Mec, il bougeait pas, je voyais pas son torse bouger. Je, je, je voyais pas son torse bouger, frère. Ah. Rough Rider. Ah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, the Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Do you remember the song? I don't know exactly why I'm. Uh, I like this style, but I know I don't, I don't have the same style like like my friend uh, in Paris, in France, exactly. <coughs> I have more inspiration from uh, from the uh, United States. Ça me dit là. Tu sais c'est quoi ça? Martin. Oh yeah. Na na Tu peux tu t'as non tu connais pas? Ah. Mes frères. Il était tellement, tellement drôle, Lorenz, frère. Aujourd'hui encore, je regarde encore. This is a, the Martin Lawrence show. So funny, so funny. You can watch this now, it's, 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 it's keep funny, man. <laughs> he, he student, he come to say, yo, my man, give me, yo, where is my money? Silent, silent, et là, il vont des chicotes. Silence, punk. <laughs> Martin Lawrence, no. Yeah, first day of fight week. It's exciting. It's always exciting to get here, you know, to the city we're fighting. Now it's Houston. This week we're mostly focused on cutting the weight. So I got a little a bit of pounds to go. No, I got Gilbert Burns now here, so he's kind of adjusting a little bit of things that that we could do in the fight. And Daniel always, you know, keeping my striking on point. Yeah, we've been training together, being a close friend for I don't know, maybe almost 10 years. We're always helping each other. I was about to bring him to my last fight, but they just closed his fight. I said, no, I'm not going to mess up with his camp. But now I'm here to help him. He got a very tough fight in front of him, Michael Chiesa. He was a top 10 on the lightweight, now he's a top 10 on the, on the world to weight. If you can get push that, it's also good. It's also good. He can go either way, to be honest, because Kiesa is very, very good. And I think whoever wins is going to get a big step closer to the title, and I think he'll be presented by a finish. Não é sacanagem não, eu acho que eu nasci numa época muito doida. Pô, olha o estilo da música, filho. Puta que pariu. Ah, pô, você não é nem nascido dessa música. Não é? Não é nem nascido. Não, pra tomar o cu, já. Caramba. Sim, sem dúvida nenhuma. Acho que essa parte é mais difícil do que a luta, né? A luta eu acho que... Se você executar aquilo que você treinou, a luta em si é muito mais um investimento, você está bem tratado, bem alimentado, então chegar lá a fazer aquilo que você treinou e se divertir, né? Cara, então, o Aldo hoje ele se mantém já num peso baixo, né? Ao contrário da, das outras lutas quando ele jogava na categoria pena, que ele não se preocupava muito com isso. Só que agora, depois que ele baixou de categoria, ele viu a necessidade de realmente se manter leve, né? Se alimentando bem. Então isso facilita muito. E assim a gente vai balanceando, faz assim que a gente tem feito, entendeu? Porque a gente tem um histórico dele, é muito mais fácil seguir e repetir tudo que deu certo. Entendeu? Do que ficar inventando a cada, a cada perda de peso. Mano, hein?
try to be low key and drive this truck, but you got the camera all on. Big fella, what's up, brother? Good, how you doing? Let's see, how you feeling? All you're doing is training, and your strength and all your gains and progress comes from recovery. So, you know, recovery is a critical component when you're at this elite level. All right, that's all right. That was a good like that. All right, let's do it. What we're working with Derek right now is just trying to lower the overall inflammatory response that comes from all the training, kind of the intensity that he works at. It's my really my first time ever really doing something like this, and it's like I feel a big difference, and I'm feeling rejuvenated actually. How do you like that thing? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. We're gonna go ahead and put this over the good head like that. And we're gonna be up, stand up, kind of nice and tall, looking up, perfect, just like that. I used to neglect stuff like this. Um, never really took my body serious. Never really took care of my body, you know. Um, but now, now that I'm getting older, and I'm wishing that I would have did stuff like this back in the days. All right, brother, how you feeling in there? My balls is cold. <laughs> <laughs> Mama. But now I'm feeling a lot better than what I was. All right, brother. It's going to rain, so start raining. Let's go. What, um, airplane? Ooh. United. All right, baby. Texas bound. You know, of course, I started very humble in Brazil, like training like a garage and people's garage, and friends' garage. Uh, when I moved to the United States, I already had that mindset of, uh, you know, the, the going to the gyms that I could find the best training partner so it can just push me and see what's where, what I really am, you know, what I'm capable of. And that's the reason that I came to American Top Team because I like to test myself, I like to see it you know, how I can do with the different fighters. And that's kind of giving me also the mindset that, you know, I can I can go toe to toe to anyone. And Sao Paulo is like that too, with the rent. Exactly like that. It's summer there, every day, boom. Somehow rants come like this. You live by the mantra, anyone, anywhere, and it doesn't come any bigger than anyone, anywhere, than taking on, you know, a power puncher like Derek Lewis in his hometown. Yes, 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 of course. This is, uh, this is motivation uh, to be an outsider, you know, and uh, I like that. I like that. This is not a pressure. This is going to help me to, to do a, a good show for the fans. What we know about Derek Lewis is that he carries power and he also carries power late. This guy has a really good fight IQ. When he seems like uh, done, he's not done. And he hit you back and, uh, and, you, and you done. <laughs> that's not my That's not my That's not my, that's not my, that's not my No, no. <laughs>